Pleased to meet you, my name's Ben. Nice to meet you, I'm Johnny Lazar. Pleased to meet you, Johnny. I actually earlier had a look at your shoes, they're yeah. fantastic, mate. Thanks, man. But Thank um, I've got some questions I'd love to ask you. Yep. Um, why, why did you want to get involved in this project? Well, I think um, I think any kind of charity is a good kind of thing, you know, and you've yeah. got to just push it out there and just hope for the best. And yeah. I think basically if I can, you know, do something to help the situation, then for me that's something worthwhile. Okay, because so, there's there's quite a, a peculiar story to you, isn't there? Which one? What story well, well, is I, peculiar? Well, like I said, I was looking at your... Um, your uh, shoes earlier yep. and you you said to me off off the camera that you actually do something with with barbies back in the day or something i do it? well i used to run a stall in um in camden um yeah. called uh, the dead barbie stall and um basically i just defecate barbies and put them in barbie boxes and then sell them to people for 10 pounds where are those from? Well, I get them from Pound Stretcher. Okay. So, yeah. For a pound? <laughs> For a pound. So I'd get like 20 Barbies, 20 pounds. I'd go home, I'd get the flamethrower out. We'd melt them a bit. We'd stick their hands in their heads, make them look really scary or whatever. We have like loads of different kinds of Barbies. We had pregnant Barbie, all sorts of stuff. And then Siamese Twins Barbie and things like that. There's oh loads of really God. weird things, fun things. But it's all fun. And then, and then I'd take them, put them back in their boxes, all messed up. And then I put them on the stall, and um, and people would buy them. And wow. I'd make I'd make like necklaces and earrings as well, and and it was good fun, and it paid the rent. And How it, long did you do that for? Um, I did it for a couple of months. Um, and the women that ran the stalls in Camden, she was really pleased that I was doing it because she was like, this is kind of different and fun, and so it was good. It was it was it was a healthy living. <laughs> so when you heard this was about uh, cancer, teenage cancer, were you were you scared? No. Or were you okay with it? Um, I don't think you should be scared of anything, though, eh? So I think really with this, I think there's nothing to be scared about. I think you just gotta, you know, I'm just basically all I'm doing is I'm just singing, you know? I'm just, I'm gonna go and sing. It's like I'm not the one that actually has cancer that has to deal with that. So I'm not scared, <laughs> you know? No. I've, I've only got to sing, you know? It's people, people that have cancer and stuff, they have a lot more problems, they've got to deal with it, but you know, you, there's no point in being scared in any sense, you've just got to kind of get on with it, really. You sound, you sound like you're quite up on it. I mean, do you know do you know anyone or have had anyone that's had cancer in, um, in your family I've, or anything? Personally, family, I mean, obviously, there's all sorts of different kinds of cancer. I've, I've, I've had relatives that had stomach cancer. My granddad had stomach cancer, I had to get his stomach lining taken out. Right. But you know, like with, with, with all forms of cancer, I think with friends that know friends, that know other friends, you, you generally do know somebody. Mm. I mean, it affects so many people. And um, there's enough warnings now in cigarette packets and, and all sorts to let people know these things. Yes, I think, yeah, we've all, we've all known somebody, you know, so, yeah. That's good, that's very, very good of you to say. So, I mean, um, so take it this has been a very rewarding, rewarding project for you, yeah? Yeah, well, yeah? I, 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 for me, yeah, I, I think if you're going to give something, then that's good, you know, you put some energy into something that's positive then there can be no wrong in that. So I think it's a good thing. You know? Johnny, it's been brilliant speaking to you today. Thank you, Thank you so much for your shoes. Too. I think That's you're right. going to get a good reception from them. From the <laughs> yeah, me too. Well. I okay. hope so. So thank you very much, buddy. Thanks, man. And no I'll worries. see you again. That's all right. Thank you.